my second or third time doing something in my yard, other than just sitting around having a martini. <laughs> <laughs> How many trips to the car does this take? Usually, believe it or not, one trip. One trip, all right. Yeah. I'm going to try something really radical. Yeah, yeah. Color. How about there? Is that Viridian? No. Light, <laughs> light turquoise. You ever see, you ever, uh, see Wolf Kahn's work? He uses colors in his landscapes in pastel where he pushes the colors. Like he'll use a pink sky and a yellow tree. I know use a color like this in there, uh -huh. but he he makes this stuff work. The it's value amazing. structure? Yeah, it's just it's just neat what he does. Ooh. See what happens. Maybe that will be perfect, but I'm gonna tone it down a little I don't think I really uh, learned how to paint until I went into until I started over at Disney and then I was introduced to plain air painting. Is that through your job or on the oh, free yeah, time I with the guys? Year, like about eight years ago. Going back about eight years I was working at Disney feature animation. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was background painters and visual development guys that were painting all the time. And I just really loved what they were doing, so I just took it on my own to kind of pick it up. Did you guys go out and paint? Yeah, we did. <laughs> There's probably a lot to learn, you know, about painting by uh, just being around those guys doing background. Yeah, I think it was a, it was a, a. I think just putting anybody in a really intense art community where it's just top-notch artist, uh, you, you, you pick up a lot and you learn a lot. How often do you get to go out and paint? Um, during the school year, not as much as I'd like. Is there any excuse to bring some of the game art kids out into the wilderness? Yeah, I had, um, we would do, at the beginning of the semester, just do like a little landscape drawing thing, mm -hmm. just to kind of get them out of the lab. And at the end of the semester, I had an optional day for everybody to go out to the beach and to do landscape painting. Did they go? No. Did you go? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How many years of drawing do most of these guys have? Uh, well, my friend Ilya's wife, she is Russian. Um, and she is 30 right now. She has 25 years of training. <laughs> <laughs> So, so she can draw. She can draw and paint extremely I've well. seen her paintings. They're very beautiful. Yeah. She's really good. Now, if I were to do this over, if I were to start all over again right now, I would take more care in the uh, negative spaces here. Mm -hmm. They're a little bit crude. I would take more care so that these main stems would stand out a little bit more. And yet there could be some abstraction, but they're a little bit... There, there's a little raggediness taking place here. I think my biggest problem with watercolor is waiting long enough for it to dry. I know. They, they, I'm too impatient. <laughs> well, look at Sergeant. He didn't wait. He, he, blurred, he blotched. A lot of his stuff is blotchy because he yeah. couldn't wait. Yeah. And it, sometimes it works out, you yeah. know. Like here, I couldn't wait, so I just put the red right in the green, but I should have waited. <laughs> anyway, i to wait for it to dry, give it another. I'm going to go into the fourth quarter here. I'm in the third quarter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go into the fourth quarter here. Larry, I want lunch. Yeah. Go in and make some lunch, man. <laughs> <laughs> Get out the hot dog with all that grease and cholesterol. Come on. Come on.